Hello, Peter here from Woodrow Handcrafts in Gympie and in this video I'm going to show you how you can add lettering to an embroidery, to an embroidery design on the Memorycraft 500E. So the first thing you need to do is select your design. So this is the one we've selected in a previous video about getting designs uh, from your USB stick. Then all you need to do is go to the edit screen. So you need to press home, press edit and you'll see a eagle now comes up in the center of our hoop template. We're using the SQ14B hoop. We don't want to change that but if you wanted to change that you've got your hoop selection here. Press there it'll come up with a list of the available hoops for you. You'll see down here it tells you the pages available. So we're on page 2 of 2 now, page 1 of 2. I'm staying with this SQ14B hoop. Now to add some lettering to this, press the home button again, press the ABC. Top left corner here is your um, font selection. So you've got Gothic script, Cheltenham, etc. Once again we've got page numbers here. I'm just going to stay with the basic Gothic. You've got the lettering orientation, so you've got horizontal or vertical size. We're on medium at the moment, which is fine. Press that to go to small, large, and then back to medium. And then you've got your uppercase and lowercase letters. You'll see here you haven't got any numbers, etc. Once again, page one of five, so use your right arrow, give your numbers, give your punctuation marks and then just type in what you would like to do. So we'll go to lowercase. You've got a space, so you've got a big space or a small space. Uh, press OK there. And you'll see that's come into the center of the hoop. Grab the writing so you can tell which designs you're editing or moving by the where the green box is. I just get that positioned and I'm going to put some more writing there so press home ABC again. Press OK. You can use the up and down and right and left arrows here as well to move that design around. That way you keep it completely centered. And there you go. If you'd like to have a bit of fun here, use your right and left arrows. You've got your ABC arc. So you'll see I've got an eagle is selected at the moment. I'll press on the arc. Uh, you've also got, so this will arc it, pressing the down arrow will arc it that way, pressing the up arrow will go in the opposite direction. You can see now some of the letters are a bit close to each other. You see up arrow over here on the right hand side and that will spread those out. Press OK, select our top lot, top lot of writing, press your ABC. Get that how you'd like it. I'm just going to move that over a little bit. Once you're happy with all that, press OK. And you're ready to sew.